have your pen, paper, Bible, computer, and a friend. Did you call a friend? Yes. Very selfish for you to be fed like this mm -hmm. and you're eating alone. My God. No fun in eating alone. Call a friend, call your enemy, call a family member, and let's sit around the Word of God. I have Reverend Trish Amen. to my right, I have Brother Vaughn to my left, and Reverend Rufus to my far left. They're going to join with me. We're still talking about the art of waiting on God, which is what? The way of waiting on God. Today's lesson is the effects of hope deferred. Mm. Mm. My God. That comes right out of the Bible. Wow, yes. Proverbs 13 and 12, Reverend Trish. Here begins the reading of God's holy word. Hope deferred makes the heart sick, but a longing fulfilled is a tree of life. Now, what mm. is hope deferred? Wow. I preach from this message. Yes. And by the way, you can get this message if you call in on DVD. It's called Hope Deferred. And play it until your hope changes from deferred hope My to God. hope with great expectation. Mm -hmm, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It literally means prolonged hope. Yes. It means I am not just waiting for a month. Mm -mm. I'm waiting for years. Yes. Now, I know these young men think that what they're waiting on is just taking so long. <laughs> like the car. Right? And you think it's taking so long. And that's probably just about a month or two years now or whatever. I know that you have experience waiting on the Lord. And it seems so what? So long. Yes, ma'am. I know you don't you can write the book. Yes. yes All right. Okay. Yes, yes. Prolonged hope. It means waiting beyond certain limits. Yes. Your faith is just about to give out. My God. My Somebody God. Somebody right now in Germany, mm. in Russia, mm. in Indonesia, some young man in the Middle East, some young woman sitting mm. with her with her weapon. You're just My about God. to give out. And when that happens, it, 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 it means it's dragged out. Dra you know, when something is dragged out, my God, my God, it can really work you. It can wear you out. You That's know, right. what, what are some of the things it can do to you? Make you depressed. Depressed? It can, it can make you very emotional. Emotional. Cry. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What, what else? It can make you overeat. Overeat. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Overeat. Now look who he's talking about overeat, and he's not even, you know, but it can make you overeat, all right? Now, yeah, it, it means you're, it, it, it literally means you're battle worn. Wow. You're fatigued. Yes. A lot of our servicemen and women are coming back from the Middle East battle worn. That's right, that's and right. And they have to take them to certain kinds of therapy. That's right. Just to get them back to function that's daily. That's absolutely right. Because they've been out there too long. Mm -hmm. Shell shock. Mm -hmm. Too many too many attacks. Mm -hmm. Too many bullets. Too many bombs. Too many almost got killed Kill. moments. Yes, yes, yes. Have you ever had that almost got killed yes, moment? Yes, God, yes. That can wear yes. on you. Yes, yes, it can. Yeah, close call. Yes. Effects of prolonged hope. Yes. The eagle that refuses spiritual nourishment will become sick and die. Remember mm. now, the eagle sits on a rock, yes. and he gets the sun rays, and then he opens his mouth after he beats his beak mm -hmm. and get all the calcium off. He now can open his beak and receive food from what? The, the older experienced eagles. eagles. Yes. But there's some who refused to even refused get on the rock. Eat. My God. They stayed in the valley of depression. Mm. And what happens when you stay there? You what? You die. Oh, listen to me. Please, please, My please, God. please, please, please. Go back to my God. Get, get your Bible again. Yes, yes. And go back to prayer life. Somebody offended you, yes. Somebody talked about you, wow. You know, you didn't like the way they treated your brother or your sister. The preacher fell. I, I can understand that legitimate reasons why you don't want to be bothered. But God is the only one that can take you through life. That's right. That's right. So get That's out right. the valley, the valley of despair, the valley of frustration, mm. and go where you can get food and help. The, the Christian journey will become laborious if you're walking around with a sick heart. Yes. What does prolonged hope do? It affects your what? Your heart. And the word heart is used interchangeably in the Bible with your what? Mind. With your mind. Mm -hmm. So your mind is sick, your heart is sick. My God. Countenance sick. Mm. The heart will become sick. What does it mean? Heavy, 
and yes. weary. You know, I see young people, young people your age, pe young people who have a great future ahead of them, and they're walking down. That's right. Suicidal. That's right. That's right. Cutting themselves. That's right. In the church. Mm. You're not cutting yourself, are you? No, man. Oh. Are you depressed right now? No. I remember the days when that you were. Heavy days. Wow. Yes. And what happened? I found the Lord, <laughs> for real. Oh. And I came outside of my own circumstances and saw who he was in the circumstance. I see. Mm -hmm. Now, that's a young man talking. Mm-hmm. So, you know, get your son and your daughter yes, to listen to this. Yes, 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 yes. Here are young people saying that's right. that they have now discovered that the Lord has better things or bigger things than their circumstances. Wow. Don't get weary in well-doing. You will reap if you faint not. Keep seeking God for strength to endure. His strength is made perfect mm. in your weakness. Mm. He's not expecting you to be perfect every day. But if you turn to him, his strength will pick you up. Yes, thank God. His strength will encourage you. Mm -hmm. He wants the opportunity to uphold you. My Give God. him a chance to lift you. Yes. Mm. And what does Lamentation 3 and 25 say? Here begins the reading of God's holy word. The Lord is good to those who hope in, is whose hope is in him, to the one who seeks him. He's Praise good. God. Praise God. You, you know, I, I know that this is a very difficult time. Recession. Yes. A lot of people leaving the church. The church is losing its young people. And you don't have to leave the church to leave God. That's right. A large percentage of the young people and even the That's older right. people That's in right. church, they have no hope. They are living with a with a fatalistic kind of spirit. Mm. They are also committing what? Spiritual suicide. Yes, yes. And some of them even are thinking about cutting themselves. I don't know why I keep hearing mm. somebody cutting themselves mm. because you've lost your hope. My Today God. God has a better way. My God. All you have to do is seek counsel. Yes. Yes. And we pray for you right now. I will right. rebuke the spirit of destruction. Right. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Now mm -hmm. here is the reflection. The reflection. The reflections of today. Lingering waiting can really cause depression. Ask yourself, how am I caring for myself in this wait? Are you focusing on God or your circumstances? Are you anxious and are you grieved? Has your journey become laborious? Seek help. As pastor says, biblical counseling can sustain you if applied. There is indeed another side of the weight. Another side Praise of the weight. Praise God. I Praise watched God. you cross over, and I'm seeing you crossing over, mm -hmm. and we cross over many times yes. together, yes. okay? Yes. And you are crossing over. Yes. I'm speaking to a mother right now. Wow. Do not be discouraged. Mm -hmm. Get this CD. A new sound. It is the cheapest, but one of the most effective weapons you can buy. Get it, and it'll help you rid yourself of torment. So hope and the sound. Yes, yes. Sometimes all you need is a sound to get you through the most. My God. All you need is a word spoken That's right. to your spirit That's right. that will break the glue. That's right. That's right. Do not sit and allow prolonged hope mm. to break your heart. My God. I'm talking to somebody with a broken heart today. Yes, yes, yes. A divorce. Yes. A bad relationship that a, a bad relationship, a relationship that went sour. Wow. A job that they gave you a pink slip that you've given 20 years of your life to. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Don't give up. Don't give up. I want you to hope in the Lord. They that hope in the Lord shall never be ashamed. Tomorrow, same time.